Hi YouTube, today I will be doing a review on how to get internet. There is a couple of ways which I would recommend to do it, but um, I will be showing you all the ways that I would do it. So um, first of all, I will be showing you how to get internet, providing you do this right. Um, what you do, you go into settings, and I actually learned this off of a friend. Um, a friend in my year 11 class showed me this. Uh, what you want to do, um, go to internet, go to Wi-Fi networks. I know it doesn't say that there's a Wi-Fi network present, which is okay, because I have come prepared for this. What you do, you go to an application called eWiFi. I will be doing a review on how to get this. I will be reviewing it very, very shortly. So, um... It looks like that. It's got an E and it's got a signal boost strength on it. It's called E Wi Fi. You do you click onto that? This is a, this is also a very good way to, to get internet, which links into the first way. As you can see, there are two open networks called BT Open Zone and BTFON. What both of them require is you to have a an account set up with a BT network, which is um you can do you can go into it. This is one of the cons of having this application because sometimes it does freeze. It has all the details like the MAC address, security, the signal strength, the channel, and the noise. All the details are here. So the MAC address, the actual security, the signal strength, the channel, and the noise. Well, what you want to do, you want to go to connect. And hopefully, sometimes it does say that connection request status the connect time out message will come up which is okay because there is a setting for this which um is down here don't know if you can see but it says setup go into that it says auto scan what that means that is that the application will scan for any um nearby networks and it will do that every 10 seconds obviously if you've put it off it won't do that Auto connect, very similar. If there is any open networks, it says here, e Wi Fi will connect to the open Wi Fi network automatically. So, when it upon finding an open internet network, it will connect, which is cool. So, another way is um, you go into the network and you say, for instance, you want to do that one. You go to connect, it's going to have the same layout as the odd one and do, we'll say please enter password. So what you want to do is go to the keyboard and type in the word guest, G-U-E-S-T. And then press OK and then press join. Sometimes it says that but really what you want is like um same sort of bubble that says connection request status and it has a little loading thing which kind of looks like if you go onto something like YouTube and it has the loading little um, fan wheel you really really do need that but um if you do do this right then you will have internet and you will receive stuff like emails which is really handy you can update your Facebook your Twitter your MySpace which is really really good and you can download stuff from at the App Store Go on to Google using Safari and go on to iTunes and do many more things. Okay, um, as I always say, thank you for watching. Comment, rate, and subscribe. Do not hesitate to personal message me with your problems or your worries regarding your iPod Touch. And if I get my iPod jailbroken very soon, I will be doing a run through, a quick demonstration on how to do that. Okay, peace out. Thank you for watching. Comment, rate, and subscribe. Tell your friends, peace.